Hello, Owl friends. Today, I'm going to be collecting diamonds in Royal High, and I'm going to be showing you some diamond spots where there's tons and tons of diamonds. Owl friends, I want to show you a little secret before we start. So, sometimes when you're walking on the beach or swimming, you'll see these shells in in the water or on the beach and you can collect them and they'll give you diamonds so when the beach house first came out they used to not have shells but now they do just like sunset island so i found a shell right here in the water and i'm going to collect it and see i got 20 plus diamonds so the shells give you Diamonds, and I learned that they're normally in front of the purple house where the rocks are. So, our friends, first you want to go to Enchantix High because Enchantix High has a lot of diamonds that respawn fast. Okay, so right now, Enchantix High, what powers do you want? Ah. I'll pick these. These are random. Oh, I I got um, cold powers. I can blow ice. Ice powers. Okay. So when you first join, there's this fountain, and you can collect their diamonds. And then there'll be a mermaid pool, and you want to go inside because this mermaid pool has a ton of diamonds. Go into a random tunnel and you'll see diamonds everywhere. And then just keep collecting them. Go through different tunnels. Ooh, I found this random uh, parkour room. Okay, ah, ah, ah. <laughs> I got stuck there for a second, but if you keep going through the tunnels, you'll keep collecting the diamonds. So if you're saving up for something, this will actually help you because there's a ton of diamonds everywhere. I mean, look at how many diamonds are here. Oh my gosh, there's so many, I can't collect all of them. Then there'll be this green diamond that you'll see sometimes. And when you collect it, it'll give you 10. Now, another way to get diamonds is to buy the double diamonds pass. So it gives you more diamonds when you collect diamonds. And then you can go through these tunnels and you'll get double as many diamonds. Sometimes triple. So what you want to do is you want to click on Royal High. When you're in games, you want to click on Royal High. Then you want to click on Store. And you'll see there's all these passes. And you'll see that here is Double Diamonds. Now this is only like 750 Robux. Now here is the Quadruple Diamonds but 1,700 Robux. So that's actually a lot, but they actually help you get more diamonds. And you should also buy faster flight if you have enough because that'll help you go through the tunnels faster and collect more diamonds. So right now I think I should buy the faster flight pass. Okay, I'm gonna buy now. And there we go. I bought the faster flight. See, it says owned. Okay. So now I'm going to show you another place where they got tons of diamonds. Oh, and there's also some diamonds in the fountain. Right here, right here, and right here. You need to look uh, at the water and they'll show the, where the diamonds are. But anyway, Alfred, let's go to the next map okay all friends so now that I collected all the diamonds in Chantix High I'm just gonna check that off there we go and then you want to go to Royal High new campus okay there we go uh, it's right now loading 
Okay, there we go. So there's a ton of diamonds in Royal High New Campus. Like a ton. When I say a ton, I mean a ton. That's why I got uh, the fast flight pass so that I can get all of them. Okay, so I believe there's one on the carriage. Okay, there. then there's also some in the forest. There's like a ton on in the forest. Just keep going around the forest and under almost every tree there'll be some diamonds. I'm gonna skip them because there's so many. And when you finally, finally get to the top, there'll be this tent. Make sure to collect this one. This one is worth some diamonds. Okay. Okay, so right here is a red diamond. And the red diamond is worth um, 20 diamonds. But if you get quadruple, and uh, don't forget the double diamonds passes, then you then that red diamond will be worth 120 diamonds. And if you keep going, that's going go here. So this is where you're supposed to spawn. Right where the carriage is, there's one right here. There's also some at the top. Okay, and when you get in, there'll be this big diamond here, where the crown is. This is where the apartments are. No, ah. Okay, and then there'll be some in the principal's office. Now, there's none on top of these lockers, but one time when I went over here, there were some diamonds. So there's diamonds if you go upstairs on two of the lockers, not every single one. I'll skip breakfast. <laughs> okay. Now I want to go into the principal's room because the principal's room has a lot of diamonds. So when you get into the principal's room, there'll be this uh, red diamond in the fireplace worth 20 diamonds. So there'll be some on these seats and the principal seat. And finally, there'll be this one on the balcony. There's also some stairs in the principal's room, but there's no stair and there's no door here. <laughs> okay, and so now that I'm out of the principal's room, you want to go upstairs and over here, there'll be some diamonds on the side. There we go. I'm gonna collect these, that one, this one, and don't forget this one. And there we go. And even and if you move in, okay, I'm gonna move in to this room. It doesn't matter which one; they're all the same. You can claim any one of them, and there should be some diamonds here, or one. Oh my gosh, there used to be two. I guess they changed it so there's only one. There used to be one in the middle. I guess they changed that. And I'll also go into this room because I believe there's a diamond here. Yep, right here. And now I'm going to leave this apartment. Apartments. Okay, there we go. There's also some in other places uh, too. There's actually a ton here, but if you keep exploring and exploring, uh, you'll find a ton. So there's also some where the pool is. Not in the pool, but you'll see this waterfall. And if you go through it, there'll be some diamonds. Oh my gosh, I just collected one accidentally <laughs> too. Okay, then you'll have to go through this wall and you'll see that there's diamonds everywhere. There, there, and ah, just went through the water. <laughs> okay, and that's all of them. They're everywhere on the wall. And then when you're done, make sure to go over here because there'll be a lighthouse here and there'll be a red diamond on top. 
There we go. If you really want these diamonds, this map is so big, so you'll really need faster flight. But there's also some one diamond in these clams on the side. Okay. There. And then if you go to the top roof, there's also some diamonds here. And there's a ton of diamonds. But if you go on the beach, there will also be some diamonds. And that's all the diamonds that I know. <laughs> because uh, guess what? This map is so big, there might be more. So as I said, owl friends, uh, if you keep exploring, you'll find new parts of this map and even more diamonds. There is supposed to be a diamond here, but my skirt accidentally touched it and I collected it. XD. But anyway, Owl Friends, we will see you in the next video. Bye! Woohoo! Oh, wait, one second. I'm gonna stand on a cloud. Woohoo! Okay, so there's supposed to be some diamonds up here. Ah! <laughs> I'll just collect these diamonds here. And then you need to go through, and there'll be some diamonds on the wall. Like here, and here, and here. Ah! I just got stuck!